helmets. Which one's the best one? Well, stick around and we'll find out, including from these guys back here. Hello and welcome. My name is JD and today we're going to do another easy Minecraft tutorial. This time we're going to find out how to craft and use helmets as well as turtle shells. So first of all, they're pretty easy to craft. If we want a leather cap, you just use leather in this shape here. If you want an iron helmet, use iron like this. A gold helmet, very similar. Diamond helmet is also the same. And we're going to leave this for a moment. But I want to make two of these, actually. So there we go. And netherite helmet. We need to use a smithing table. So this one, you just put in the diamond helmet, netherite ingot, and you get your netherite helmet. Now, as for the turtle shell, you need scoots. And scoots are obtained when a baby turtle grows up into an adult. And it drops one scoot, and you need five of them to make a turtle shell. Chainmail helmets can be found in a few different ways. Uh, first of all, in Bedrock Edition, they can be found in buried treasure chests. But in both Bedrock and Java Edition, you can get them from these guys, an armorer. Uh, he's not trading it, unfortunately. You can also get leather caps from the leather worker right over here. And he doesn't have the trade right now either. You can also find helmets in chests around villages, shipwrecks, strongholds, end cities, bastions, underwater ruins, ruined portals, and that's about it. To repair helmets, you can use a grindstone. You need two like helmets, like these are two diamond ones, and you can get a new repaired diamond helmet. It does strip the enchantments, though. You can use a crafting table as well. Just Again, put two like helmets like this, or you can use an anvil. And you can place two helmets that are the same. Uh, this is also good for combining enchantments, or you can use the material. And it, this does actually work with turtle shells. Chainmail helmets can be repaired in a similar way as all the other ones. You use iron ingots to repair here. Leather caps can be dyed. As you can see there, we got a blue one now. But that's only in Bedrock Edition. In Java, you need to use a crafting table. So let's make this one into a yellow helmet. But which one is the best? Well, let's take a look at the numbers here. So a leather cap adds one armor point. Uh, it has a durability of 55. Chainmail adds two armor points, and it has a durability of 165. Iron helmet is exactly the same, no difference. A golden helmet is also two armor points, but it only has a durability of 77. Diamond helmet adds three armor points and two armor toughness, and a durability of 363. Netherite is three armor, three armor toughness, and one knockback resistance and it has a durability of 407. Now what about the turtle shell? Two plus two armor, which is the same as these three, but it has a durability of 275, which makes it better than iron. Helmets have the standard enchantments that the other armor have, but it does have two additional ones, aqua affinity and respiration. Respiration allows you to spend more time underwater. It kind of like helps you to breathe underwater. And Aqua Affinity helps you to mine underwater. But let's put this on here. We've got a turtle shell. Now, all of these you can put on the same way. Turtle shell we'll put on right here. And this has an interesting effect. As you can see in the top right hand corner, it has the water breathing effect. I'm going to go into. Uh, survival jump underwater and you'll see what happens I'm gonna just dive under and look at that you see the bubbles there it's not going down yet okay now it will 
as you can see. So what this does, the turtle shell actually gives you an extra 10 seconds underwater, which is really nice. The turtle shell also has another use. You can use it with a brewing stand with Awkward Potion to turn it into the potion of the Turtle Master. Now this is a lesser known potion, I would say, but uh, definitely check out the video. I have made one specifically for that in the top right hand corner. The Netherite Helmet has its own unique property. Uh, if you're wearing it, it doesn't get damaged if you're in fire or lava. You can smelt iron, golden, and chain helmets and get a single nugget of iron or gold. So my question is, do you like using the turtle shell? Let me know in the comment section below if you like to use that or do you prefer other kinds of helmets? If you like the video, then please give it a thumbs up. And if you're interested in seeing more easy Minecraft tutorials, then please consider subscribing. We'll see you next time. Bye bye.